Hi, my name is Fluffy the Destroyer, and welcome to my channel, man. You know, it doesn't mean that you have to pull a woman's pants down. I'm gonna be re really vulgar here, so it's it, it doesn't mean because you have to pull a woman's pants down, get her pregnant, and then you have to ignore being a parent. No, you have to be responsible at some point in your life. This guy looks like there's, I don't know, there's a couple of brain cells missing here because I don't get it. Here's the thing. There's a guy called Jeremy Hillman, who looks like he's the CEO or somewhere big in a world bank. And he noticed that at some point there's some transactions that was going on into his, into his credit card billing statement. And... The thing is, he saw like uh, those bills of $109. He wondered, well, what, what was it? And it looks like it was his son, his 13-year-old son, that spent over $4,500, yes, $5,500 on a game called FIFA. It's a soccer game, if no one knows. Uh, there's some microtransactions on, on that game. In, in a sense that there's some cards that you can buy for uh, like a couple of bucks, but the rare ones are like over a hundred dollars. Think of a lotto. It's the same principle. You pay a hundred bucks and it's possible you're going to get nothing. From a couple of bucks to a hundred. That's what I got. And... <laughs> The thing is, he takes complete responsibility of his son's action, but here's the thing, because he didn't look at his uh, credit card statement, which is the first problem, and the second problem, <laughs> wow, this is really fun, because here's, here's what he says, the answer to us is clear, he became addicted to the game, which he didn't know, because, I mean, he doesn't care about his son, I don't give a fuck's ass if that guy works a lot. You have a son, take care of him. Know him. It's a freaking job. He's spending $100 was easy as a click of a button. There was no, there were no barriers, and it didn't feel like real money, even though it had a dollar sign on the screen. Well, I don't know what is. If there's a dollar sign on the screen, and it's over $100, I would, like, ask him questions like, is that real money, or is that, like, in-game currency, whatever. Even from a like from an idiot point of view or no from an ignorant point of view because that's what he is really ignorant and easy as a click of a button true i would say that this is a political lie because it's not entirely false but it's not entirely true i don't have a console but i know one thing if you buy something with your credit card which means you have to enter, enter the information on your credit card, you can remove it. If you didn't know that, you're the dumb ass here. Really big dumb ass here. <laughs> and on the article, it says that there's no password barrier. Well, you can't remove the card, so I think that's really fair enough, you know. And besides, he's 13 year old. He shouldn't have a credit card in his account anyways. And using your account, well, your credit card on his account, it's pretty fucking dumb if you ask me. Really, really dumb. <clears throat> and the thing is, I had no knowledge of the $100 in-game purchase could even be made with, uh, like, no wish of credit card. And that was really, really, really easy. I mean, Apple does the, almost does the same thing, but they got passwords and all. But the thing is, even though it's kind of true that Xbox uh, credit card information, which is kind of, it is weak. Like, there's no limit. Like, if I spend over $100, log the account, or log the spending, or something like that. There are a couple of settings, but it's not strong enough. But just the fact that you can remove the credit card, to me, that's strong enough. Like, really. 
there shouldn't be any information of your credit card on that on any console or anything really there shouldn't be it's your credit card especially if you can spend more than like 1000 2000 or so it's your problem and he didn't uh, get reimbursed because that's his responsibility beside microsoft told him like listen your account your problem seems to be pretty fucking fair to me <laughs> i mean think about it you have a son 13 year old and i don't care if you work too much or something but if you don't know what he's doing uh it's your problem besides it's your credit card bill statement forty five hundred dollars for fuck's sake do yourself a fucking favor stop working or something do less hours spend more time with him or something my god <laughs> It, and the thing is, that guy has the guts to blame Microsoft for all this bullshit. If Microsoft uh, wanted to spare uh, thousands of parents from frustration, anger, and sometimes serious financial consequences, they would find a hundred ways to do it. And here's the thing. The guy is acting like a complete fucking bitch. And, and this is how... I don't know, man. If I had a child sir If I knew where he was, I would call child service on him. Seriously, he is not fit to be a parent. I'm, I'm that fucking pissed off. And if there's a lawyer out there, like, this is like an indirect uh, threat to Microsoft, which is, out, like, I don't know, I'm mind blown here. Uh, if there's a lawyer out there, that they want to start a clash action lawsuit against Microsoft and force them into compensation and adopting a better policy. I'll be happily signing up. What? Remove the fucking credit card info from the from the Xbox console for fuck's sake. That's strong enough. Yes, give yourself the feedback that you need to Microsoft. That's what they need to do. Go on, uh, go on their forum, talk about it. Don't be a fucking bitch and do a class action lawsuit. I'm going to laugh at you. I'm not going to support. No one's going to support this bullshit. Everything is there. Hell, you know what? Use PayPal. You need a password to use this. It's strong enough. Besides, but it is true, though. There's a couple of things that's true to what he says. Though. I'll give him a couple of uh, points for that. Number one, if you spend more than $100... The credit card company does nothing, or Microsoft or FIFA doesn't do nothing. Like, you can spend as much as you want. Like, um, in the article, it says that his son, like, spent multiple times, uh, well, a couple of hundred dollars to, for his account. He didn't do any, he, he didn't know anything. Not a single call from the bank, like, listen, we saw a couple of tra transactions going in at once. Are you sure if everything is okay there? Is this supposed to be happening? Simple call from the bank. That's what they usually do, but for some reason they don't. I don't know. Looks like they were, I don't know, they were used to the guy's uh, purchase. I'm not sure here. And yes, it is kind of true that on Xbox, the security regarding the credit card, like beside the fact that you can remove the credit card information is really weak. Yes, it is true. Uh... It could be better, yes. But a class action lawsuit? No, man. Come on, man. Fuck off. Just pay your bills and get the get the hell away from here. <laughs> this is the most insulting thing that I can know. Like, uh, and in the article, Evan, I don't know if it's this is the one or his own, uh, or his own uh, kind of blog or something. I guess. Uh, and here's the thing. I really want to know where this is because you also told something that's really pissing me off here. Ah, here it is. Um, so, you know, after spending 4500 4, I don't know about me, but if it was me, <laughs> oh my god, I wouldn't beat the fucking crap out of my kid. Man, I would love to, but I'm going to make him pay. If I was a parent, like... I'm not rich here. I'm really not rich. The only thing I know, if if one of my kids, because I only have one, but if, if, if my kid would do that, I would make him pay. I don't fucking care what age he is. I would find him a job, and you're going to make me, you're going to pay this. 
in no fucking way I'm going to pay for this. Well, I'm going to pay it on front, of course, not to have some problem with the credit card company, but after that, he's going to pay. He's going to earn it. This kid has to know what earning is. Like, you can't just, like, spit and then have a car or have, a, like, an Xbox. Kids today have to know what the, what the word earning is. This seems to be lacking. And here, my wife and I accept our responsibility in this. We should have paid much closer attention to his video gaming. Well, yeah, he, he seemed to be, like, really freaking addicting to that, to that game. And my son accepted responsibility and punished me. He lost his Xbox. Here's the thing that's really, really weird. I don't know if it's a typo or something, but this is the, like the next line. He has lost his Xbox. He has been promised a table tennis table, but that is on hold. What? No, 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 you're not going to get it. Fuck you. You're going to pay me. And that's it. It's over. Like the trust is completely off. <laughs> number one thing this kid should have went to his parents like first of all like hey I saw this game there's a couple of things blah 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 I can spend money blah 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 you know just ask permission in the first place hundred dollars a couple of bucks I don't care ask permission he should have had this kind of behavior this attitude of hey this costs money I'm gonna ask him first of all earning you know, <laughs> no. And here's the thing. Um, losing $4,500 for many families would be a life-changing disaster. Fuck yeah. Uh, for us, it's very upsetting and means that we'll have to dine our tighten our belt and forego some luxuries. <laughs> some luxuries? What? I don't care if it's fucking luxuries or if you're rich or so. You... No one seems to get it in this story, especially him. He doesn't care about that law. Oh, you know what? Spend some dollars, I don't care. He's not going to get his table. It's on hold. He'll eventually get the tabletop tennis that, uh, that I promised him, because he's a good little boy. Fuck you. You know what? <laughs> wow. Oh, thank God I don't know the guy, because I'd call child service on his ass, because he doesn't deserve to be a parent. This kind of parent, I... Oh, man. Fuck off, you know what? Fuck you.